So a new feature has just been added to Google Classroom, and that is the ability to create a Google Meet within your Classroom class. So if you're gonna have a Google Classroom uh, Meet that's specific to a specific class that you have, which again, a lot of times you have different classes for different hours. So some teachers might want a different meet for third hour, a different meet for fourth hour. Um, if you want one meet for everybody, this isn't going to help you. Um, but if you wanted to meet specifically to a class, there is now a feature in Google Classroom to be able to turn that on. So I am on Google Classroom and I'm inside of a course. And if I click on my little gear in the upper right hand corner, this tells me the details of that class. And if I scroll down, there is now an option that says meet and I can tell it to generate a meet link. And once I do that, it has now generated a Google meet link specific to this course. And right underneath it, you can tell that this is a visible link to students. So if I click save, um, now if a student comes into this course, and they would uh, come in, they're gonna see this link right here at the top that says meet link. And they can simply click on it and join that link or join that meet anytime uh, you are present. So if they try joining the meet and uh, you are not there, they won't be able to access it. Uh, but if you have joined already, uh, then they can click on that link and it works just like Google Meet did before. They can allow their camera and they'll be able to join that specific link for that specific Google Classroom. Um, and now that they have joined, um, they have the ability to uh, participate. Now, if you are done with your Meet, uh, all I have to do is I can simply go up here to that gear again and scroll down and simply turn off the visible to students and then click Save and now that link disappears. So instead of having to post or schedule assignments, um, you can actually now simply add that link directly to your course and then hide that link uh, whenever you are finished, which is uh, pretty handy. The other option I have is if I go down into that meet link, I can choose to copy that link. Uh, so if I wanted to still give that link out, I could do that. Uh, I can also reset that link. If I'm having issues and wanted to generate a new one, I could tell it to reset and it would generate a new link as well. So that's a new option uh, to, again, have your own classroom video link for Google Meet. And you can turn that off and on in the uh, visibility in your settings.